Welcome back to the Kenny Wallace Show brought to you by Jegs, the leader in high performance aftermarket car parts. Go to jegs.com. Well, I hate to say it, but we were right. The Herminator doesn't like to be right. But as NASCAR has always said, do not mess with our new next gen bodies. So as we've already ported, um, historic points, $400,000 in fines, uh, hundreds of points taken away. You know, listen, this is another lesson to all the, the team owners, the engineers, you, you cannot jack with the body. And, and I wanna add this to it. Everybody believes that Hendrick Motorsports is in bed with NASCAR because of their affiliation helping out, you know, with everything that NASCAR does. Hendrick does do a lot of testing for NASCAR. So everybody thinks they're in bed with NASCAR. I'm here to tell you right now that this, this puts this all to rest. NASCAR does not play any favorites with any teams. Listen, this is short and sweet. Our manager, Charlie Marlowe, has reported on this. I'm gonna leave you with this. Don't mess with the new NASCAR gen body. This one could be severe because NASCAR does not like it when you fool with the parts they give you. NASCAR has always said, we're going we're gonna to sell this car to you because you've all asked for fair. Everybody wants to be fair. So you have to have your body on your car identical to everybody else. So the big story in the garage area at Phoenix was this. Hendrick Motorsport and Justin Haley, the number 31 car of Colleague Motorsport, they had questionable louvers on the hood of their car. Now, you're saying, what are you talking about, Herman? Louvers. Louvers are nine times out of ten meant to let heat escape out of the motor compartment. Now, we've seen these for years on uh, Camaros, on the hood of cars, passenger cars. The motor gets hot or there's air coming through the radiator. There's a lot going on in that motor compartment, right? Air comes in the front of the car, gets trapped inside the car. The louvers let air escape out. And what it does is, number two, it's let, it lets air escape. And it lets, number two, it lets heat escape. Two things. The louvers do two things. Let heat escape, but also lets air escape, and that could be less drag. So in other words, the air comes through, gets stuck in the motor compartment. It's called drag, slows it down like a parachute, but the louvers let the air go out. So two things, the louvers are a big deal. NASCAR started looking, said, I don't like these, we're gonna take them. How come Hendrick Motorsport louvers look different than all the other cars? Now, this is a deal, it's severe, because after the race, Jeff Gordon in the press conference said like this, them big old bushy eyebrows and Gordon's, they went like this. They went like that. And I went, uh-oh, because me and Jeff are good friends. And I know Jeff's quirks. When Jeff's like this, all is good. When Jeff goes, that means he's serious. Them big old eyebrows came down. He says, Jeff Gordon said. I can tell you it was weighing on all of our minds, you know, coming into today and, and certainly um, will continue. I mean, I, we had some conversations. We continue to have conversations with NASCAR um, you know, this is every situation sort of unique, but this one is a more unique one than I've seen in a while where there's been a lot of communication back and forth on this particular part, especially for this racetrack, um, you know, because they did a parody test in the wind tunnel. And so I think it, it really opened up the door for some miscommunication. And, you know, I don't want to go into any further than that, but, um, you know, we uh, will continue to, to just share all the facts and, and, and be transparent with NASCAR as we have so far. This has been on our mind for two days. They're worried about it. So what will these penalties be? Will there be any penalties? But the bottom line is Hendrick Motorsport and the number 31 of Justin Haley. Now, you know, Colleg 
the 31 of Justin Haley, they got other cars too. You know, they got almond dingers. So how come the 31 louvers looked a little different than say AJ Allmendinger in the 16? So th that is interesting, but the Hendrick group, they all had, you know, questionable louvers. So uh, it's gonna be very interesting to see what happens if they get massive penalties. Now, if NASCAR, here, here's the bottom line. If NASCAR deems that Hendrick uh, fooled with anything on this body, it's big. And it's right there. Here's the reason Herminator can't call bullshit. Because now they got these real, it's like in some black and white. Remember back in the day last year, I could say, this, is, this ain't gonna make a difference. Well, now, with this new next gen car, they got all these rules and they're very explicit. Number one rule, do not mess with the body. If you are caught messing with the body and you don't call us, you don't talk to us because all the NASCAR teams are right there in Concord, North Carolina. Welcome North Carolina. You know, Childress is probably the farthest away up there and welcome, but you can call NASCAR up and say, we need one of your officials. And that, that's how close everything is down there in Charlotte. That's why we all live down there, because you needed to be there in case MRN Radio wanted you, anybody wanted you, you could juke and jive and you could be there. That's why all the drivers, nine out of 10 of them live right there. Uh, so those officials will come and go, okay, good, not good. Um, so this could be this could be uh, good, bad, and, and the ugly. Uh, Jeff Gordon shows concerns in uh, the victory lane a press conference after the Phoenix race. This is going to be uh, it's going to be interesting to watch, but I, I want to leave you with this, and, th and this is my biggest takeaway from this: these louvers were found before the cars even got on the racetrack, so there was no disadvantage, there was no advantage. Excuse me. Either way. You know, some drivers could say, hey, it didn't matter. Well, okay, is it a disadvantage? Anytime you mess with anything, it's going to be an advantage. These teams are too smart. So, um, had nothing to do with practice, had nothing to do with qualifying. It's just that NASCAR found them. They, the, the, tr the cars come out of the truck and trailer. They go through a rigid tech inspection. The cars go on jack stands. NASCAR crawls underneath them, looks at every little thing. So, uh, there was there was no advantage. The Hendrick, you know, look, Kyle Larson still set quick time, still was fastest in all practice sessions. So the Herminator de bullshitted that one for you right here. And uh, that's that. All right. So we're going to see. We're going to see what happens. But it could get ugly. Uh, if it doesn't get ugly, I'll be shocked because they were different looking enough. And those engineers at Hendrick, they got to look at them and go, should we put these on the car or not? Woo, NASCAR found him. So, um, all right then, listen, we're gonna see how it turns out. Uh, it always comes out on Tuesday or Wednesday. We're right here, right now. We're live reporting on this. So NASCAR just announced it and here I am talking about it. All right, everybody, until then, remember when podcast form, you're on your way to work, check us out on iTunes or Spotify. Until the next one.